Hello everyone, this is Dao here with uh, another video. This is basically another unboxing video. I kind of do a lot of these now rather than actual video blogs. Like I done there was one last Friday, not last Friday, last Thursday for Kingdom Hearts. And the thing is though, I actually didn't expect I was actually going to do an unboxing for this here. I'm pretty much, you probably seen a million of these already, but like, um, for people who just sort of watch my videos and that, and just sort of get my little unboxing boxing way and um, it's for you and um, as I said I wasn't actually expecting to get this but I was actually watching someone unbox this this morning just before I headed out and and the thing is well, I wasn't even gonna I don't wasn't even sure I was gonna get the actual game itself but I actually ended up getting the box and um, so I did. I also got, as I said, just before the unboxing though, I actually got this as well today, which is Dragon Age Origins and the expansion, Awakening, on the PC, because since I have a good PC now, then I might as well get them. Like, I already got them on the 360, but since I have a good PC to run them now, since I believe that it's a period version. Lucky as well, these were both the last copies, both of them were the last copies in the store, so they were. So, it must have been my lucky day, and it was my lucky day because the fact is that I went to the store that I want to get the box, this big box for, didn't have it, um, except they sold it like two months ago for pre-orders, but it's online, but I have to order it and then have to wait like maybe a good day or two, so it would have. And then I went to GameStop, yeah, a lot of people love GameStop, don't they? And they went there and asked if they had it, and they said they were having pre-order only. But then guy came, was just about to walk away. He said, "Actually, I've won it. Yet. We actually have won." The person cancelled. Someone cancelled their deposit or pre-order on it or whatever, and I got it. And of course, it is this big bad boy. It is Halo Reach, the Legendary Edition. As I said, I wasn't expecting to get this game whatsoever though, like, I'm not a huge fan of the Halo series though, and, but after seeing the unboxing video of it the, the day there, I just said, man, this is a pretty cool edition, this is a pretty cool collector's thing, the stuff you get in it is pretty class in my opinion though, and like, sure it is like a hundred pound now, but I think what you're getting is, I think it's worth it get, I guess anyway. Like some things you get for like that price or maybe less and some of it's junk. So anyway, let's get going here with it now. So let's get this moving first of all. I'm sorry about that it's far away though, but this is pretty much the best sort of you know view I can get now. Um Cut this with the scissors. That's cut all right if it's on this side as well. So I'm probably gonna wreck the bloody track at the end as well. No, I think that's done all right. Let's try this again. Let's see if it's. I think that's done all right now. So let's lift this off. No, this one's still fucked. This is going to be taking about 50 minutes. <laughs> 50 minutes later, six part video. This, this side is not meant to be pretty good for some reason. And finally, there we go. And as you can see, this is basically what you get in it. at the top. They've got styrofoam and that there. This is a huge thing here itself. As you can see, this is like little wee things here. It's basically a um, little ladder thing in this sort of form. It's hard to see there now, the lighting though, but it's pretty cool what you get anyway. And this is just basically a little insanity instructions you get for like the statue itself of the noble team. So it is, see there, pretty cool. Uh, I'm trying to get this side now, which is uh, not letting me do so. I'm going to have to cut this open as well. 
Uh, thank goodness though, it's better off getting scissors or something before I started this, because if I didn't, I would have been taking five minutes just to open stupid things. Um, it's a pretty cool pot box as well, I really like the box of it, so do. It's a really nice looking box. And it's like a little sort of lock case, so it is, so, and I don't know how to act and supposed to open it, I think I actually pull it out, yeah, pull it out. And again, there's the game itself inside, Halo Reach. So it is nice. Along with this little package thing as well. So here it is, it comes in a black case, I believe. So it is. It's another little ladder thing. There's a lot of little wee trinkets, though. So I would uh, probably think we'll be seeing the actual game itself, though. There you go. And there's a little wee Porsche lot in it as well, which is pretty cool. I believe it's a journal, so I've always seen it, so, which I think is really, really, I think this is definitely a cool little collector's item, so it is, the amount of stuff you get, it's, like, it's actually a little journal, as you can see, it's very hard to see now, the lighting's really in the way though, but, as you can see, there's like a lot of stuff in it, like just little letters and diary, and diary pretty much, like trinkets and that there, and you can see, just like photos and, just things like that there. It's, it's, I think it's really, really cool, I have to say though. I think this is a, this is a map of Reach sodas, which I think will be hanging on the wall, because it just looks really nice sodas. And um, kind of looks like Earth, <laughs> in a way. So it does. So that's basically what you get there, so you do. And put the styrofoam there. Take these bad boys out now. This is the statue you get with mobile team in it. It's really nice though, it's not the best for the eye camera thing, it's pretty, it's not, it's really nice, I think it's really nice to eat here though anyway, so I do, um, so it's really nice to eat here, and the weapons are here for each of them, so they are, you just have to assemble them on to their things themselves, I said it's a really nice statue, I'll probably have put this in my room though, as I said, I'll keep the box anyway. I think that's pretty much all you get in it now. Is there anything else? I don't think you do. <laughs> I think I'll be pretty much it. Yeah, that's pretty much all you get though. It's really nice though, I have to say though, what you get. It's pretty really cool. Um, Blackfish edition. And so it is. And um, basically, as I said, what you get is you get the game itself. There, it's in the black case rather than the green case. I heard the kill three one was the same. You get the really, just really nice journal. As you can see it, cover off it there, really nice, and it says a lot. It's big. It's a pretty big journal. Though. It just shows you like the diary and that there. It's just, I, I think it's. I, I think it's a. Brilliant, though. This goes to show how much Bungie, though, really care about that series, though. And I just sort of want to make this go out, and they want to go make the go out for the bang on their involvement with the Halo series now. And this is pretty much it's brilliant. So it is. It's, can't make really sense like lighting there, but as you can see, it's just really well done, though. And it's like a lot of little things in here, as you can see. So I like the cloth badge there. We got the so you in and see the pass key and it's like these little kind of you know pictures of like I think that's noble team. There's a few more little lads as well. Like a sort of a um, blueprint um, so it does. There's little other things as well. So this it's just really all this cool stuff you get in it anyway. So anyway guys. So there's a lot of things though, but 
There's a lot of people out there have done bomb boxes ones as well though, but I have to say that what you get in here and it's definitely worth it. It's just really cool, it's just a really cool collector's item at the end of the day, so it is. And um I'll be going to play this now, I'm uploading this and then probably go off the playlist then and probably will let you know my thoughts on the game sometime soon. So anyway guys, that's all for now, so take care and catch you later.